With great performance comes great power requirements. The RTX 4090 is a powerful GPU with a minimum requirement of 850 watts. So if you're looking for the best option to buy one, then here are our top 7 recommendations. First, we have the RM series from Corsair. If you're looking for the most reliable power supply for your new RTX 4090, then this PSU will not disappoint you. It's an 80 plus gold certified fully modular PSU. It's also equipped with a 135mm fan and it comes with a special feature called Zero RPM Mode, which causes fans to shut down in lower power usage. Most importantly, it comes with 105 degree C rated capacitors which ensure long term reliability with solid electrical performance. So if you need a PSU for your new RTX 4090 GPU, then the RM80 Plus is a really nice option for you. Moving on, we have the V1300 from Cooler Master. This is an 80 plus platinum certified fully modular with 16 AWG PSIE cables which provides improved heat resistance while improving efficiency and stability during heavy usage. The 135mm fan under the hood comes with a double ball bearing which is capable of operating temperatures of up to 70 degrees Celsius and the built-in thermal regulation mode keeps the fan under minimal pressure, ensuring both safety and longevity. On top of that, V Platinum has a dedicated switch for different power usages single mode for overclocking and multi-rail for normal mode. Lastly, this PSU is available in three different power wattages, 850 watt, 1000 watts and 1300 watts. Based on your PC's power requirements, you can choose any one of them for your new RTX 4090 build. Do you want a sleek looking power supply with a gaming aesthetic for your new RTX 4090 build? Then check out the ROG Thor Platinum 2. It comes with a very unique design including an OLED display panel on the side which indicates real-time power draw. You can even customize the lighting effects with Aura Sync on your computer. Besides the unique design, this power supply is equipped with low ESR capacitors for long-term smooth electrical performance. So if you're looking for a powerful PSU with a really cool gaming aesthetic, then ROG Thor will definitely provide you with the best experience for your new RTX 4090 GPU. Next up. We have another power supply from Corsair which is the AX Titanium version. With 94% more efficiency and lower energy consumption, this power supply is a lot quieter and cooler compared to the previous Platinum version. And it also comes with a dedicated switch for 0 RPM mode which allows the 135mm cooling fan to run in a lower load with low RPM. Also, installing the power supply is really easy with fully modular cables that come with the PSU. So, if you think you're looking for a reliable power supply for your new RTX 4090, then you can take a look at the AX1000 Titanium version. Up next, we have the Focus GM PSU from Seasonic. Those who don't want to spend too much money on PSU but looking for something reliable at the same time can check this out. It's a semi-modular 80 plus gold certified PSU that consumes relatively lower power while delivering more energy efficient operating loads. As a semi-modular PSU, the 24-pin and 8-pin ATX power cables are attached directly to the PSU and all the other necessary cables are also available inside the box including a cable bag as well. So if you run out of budget while buying the new RTX 4090 GPU, then Focus GM850 might be the most reliable option you'll find on the market. EVGA is known for designing good quality PC components for a very long time and the power supplies are no exception. Check out the Supernova GT80 Plus PSU which is enough to power up your new RTX 4090 graphics card. With 150mm length and width, this compact size power supply is equipped with 100% Japanese capacitors to ensure long-term hassle-free electrical performance. The auto eco mode feature for the fan is really helpful which causes fans to shut down automatically in a low load environment. And it comes with plenty of situational protections like OVP, OCP, OPP and many more. So you won't have any electrical issues while running the new RTX 4090 GPU with this PSU. And finally, we have the Tough Power PF1 power supply from Thermaltake. It comes in a compact size, 140mm deep, 86mm height and 150mm length. So even if your RTX 4090 takes too much space inside the case, you don't need to worry about adjusting the PSU. Additionally, this power supply also features RPM controls for its 120mm fans ensuring maximum cooling performance. On top of that, it has a dedicated switch for the small zero function feature to prevent unnecessary spinning which also minimizes the noise at the same time. So if you want a premium power supply in an affordable price range, then the Tough Power PF1 850W Platinum is a really great choice. So that was all about the 7 recommended PSUs for the new RTX 4090. Thanks for watching. If you found this video to be helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and comment below. 
to let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.